Okay, I am gonna show you a darker, fuller, bolder brow. So for those of you who don't want that super just natural, I wanna define my face, like they want their brow to stand out, this video is for you, okay? First, tools that you're gonna need. You're gonna need some kind of brow tool, okay? This one has the spoolie end that I've kind of bent sideways and then a thinner end, okay? I do like a pencil with a thinner end because you're going to put it this way and it would be the right length right? The right height, I guess, maybe would be the right word, but there it is, okay? And then I have a brow pencil that's almost out, so it's super tiny. I have brow mascara, and I have some brow powder because we want some different shading and colors. So first, I'm going to take my pencil, and we're going to, actually, what I'm going to do with this is push my brow up in the front and over, okay? Then take your brow pencil and line the underneath of your brow. Come up here, a little lighter handed, and then bring it down, okay? Then you're gonna do the same on the top, but because we want a fuller brow, we're gonna go a little bit above, maybe where your brow hairs come out of your head, not where your actual brow is. So mine are more up here, and then I just kinda lightly color and bring it down over here. So I'm kind of creating where I want this brow to go and then creating some hairline strokes. Okay, so that's what we're gonna do with that part of it. And then come in with your powder. Um, these will all come in three different shades, all the products that I'm showing you today. I just kind of barely kiss it. Don't get crazy with it or it's gonna be too much. And then come in here and fill in this area where there's just definitely no hair. Okay, just barely kiss it when you're tapping it back in there because otherwise it just gets too dark too quick. And we want the dark end, this back end to be the darker part. And then what I might do is just put a little bit on the side. Not a lot, you guys. I'm touching it so lightly because it's so pigmented right up here. This is where I was telling you the the this height, width, whatever of your brush is going to matter because you want to come in here like this. And then no more product on here. Just kind of connect all that. Okay, so then you have that little bit of shading up here, right? But then we want it darker down here at the arch. Still not crazy. We don't want it black with our, you know, gray hair. But this is where you're gonna take your time and really just fill in those areas. Okay. So then you have that fuller brow, but now we want to style it. We want to make sure we filled in all areas. That's where your brow mascara is going to come in. This comes in clear or colors. I actually like the medium for mine. And what I do is comb up right here. This is going to style the brow, fill in a little bit if you choose a color one, and then hold your brow in place. So it's almost like hairspray for your brow. And then you have that fuller, darker brow with still some really affordable products. $10.90, $11.90, $12.90. And then get yourself a brush wherever you want. This one is actually from the Morphe website. It's the Jaclyn Hill. I do really like it. Um, I've tried a lot. I tried a ton off of Amazon. This was my favorite because of this width right here. I don't, let me just show you the difference in maybe a different one. Um, say this. See how that is gonna be way too wide to, I mean, don't, don't do that. Okay, don't do that. This brush is awesome for that. If you have any questions about your brows, let me know. Um, to get your brow shape, okay, right here is where you're gonna start. Your nose, just straight up with your pencil, okay? Through your pupil is where you're gonna arch it. And from your nose to the corner of your eye is where it's gonna end. You have the perfect brow, I promise you. Um, one other tool that I really, really love from Amazon are these little razors to where you can really just kind of shape your brow. I would recommend getting them professionally done if you've never shaped your brow whatsoever, but then use these, mm, excuse me, for maintenance, okay? So have an amazing day. If you have brow questions, let me know.